Well, good morning and welcome to This Week with Pastor Dino. I'm Dino and I'm so glad to have you joining us here at First Presbyterian Church of Bradenton where we are cultivating hearts for Jesus from the heart of downtown. On Sunday morning, we talked about evangelism, so our devotional today comes from the Apostle Paul, Romans chapter 1. Let's check it out. For I am not ashamed of the gospel, because it is the power of God that brings salvation to everyone who believes, first to the Jew, then to the Gentile. So on Sunday, again, we talked about evangelism, tried to demystify it and make it not something that just pastors do or, or that Billy Graham does, but something that we all do. It's talking about our faith. It's sharing our faith story. It's being honest and, and raw about who we are in Christ and, and being willing to talk about that like we talk about everything else in our lives. Um, I think for a lot of people, maybe Paul's hitting the nail on the head here with, uh, I'm not being ashamed of the gospel. Are we ashamed of it? Do we just feel like we're ill-equipped? Um, do we feel like we're not worthy to proclaim it? All those thoughts need to be set aside. It's our job. It is part of our job description as Christians. It, from the very earliest times in the church, people were talking about Jesus, talking about their faith in a very real way. So I want you to be thinking about that. It is the power of God for salvation. And if we don't tell our story, who will? If they don't hear it from us, who will they hear it from? Be thinking about that this week and, and be strengthened and encouraged to start taking the steps necessary to be more articulate with your faith story and not be ashamed. Thanks be to God. Now this week, the church office will be open Monday through Friday, but keep in mind that one week from today is Memorial Day. The office will be closed on Memorial Day and there will not be a morning show because of that. So uh, we'll look forward to seeing you back in a couple of weeks as we kick off summer. Uh, we are starting to wind down our series, uh, One Church Many Parts. We've been going through uh, the different parts of the church and trying to add some context and some biblical grounding to each of these concepts that we throw around in church life, like ministry and evangelism and leadership and worship. And we're going to be wrapping that series on Sunday. This summer, I'm really excited about the new series we have that's called Rebellion. We're going to be doing a survey of Old and New Testament stories of, of people who faced points of rebellion. And we're actually going to look at the failures and look at maybe how transformation could have transpired in their lives, um, but they chose to rebel. And we're gonna talk about what that looks like all summer long. It's gonna be a great study. It's gonna be a good opportunity to look at many Bible characters, some of whom we know well, some of whom we don't know so well. So stay tuned for that. And we look forward to uh, presenting that to you starting here in June. Now, the big news this week is that we've got Courtyard for a Cause on Friday night. Jesse Sliger is going to be here doing music in the Courtyard. We've got Vesuvio Wood-Fired Pizza. It's a free event. starts at 6 o'clock. It's fun for the whole family. And we're going to be presenting a, a ministry uh, that's for a cause called Better Together. And they do some really great work in Manatee County. They've done really great work already here in our church family. And uh, we're going to continue building that relationship with them. But that's your opportunity to come meet them and see what they are all about. And uh, we look forward to having them here alongside with you. Invite your friends. It'll be a great time. In terms of online programming this week, we've got breakfast and Bible study on Saturday morning. That's held over Zoom. Go to bradenton.church slash zoom to find out how to connect with that class virtually. And we've got worship at 9 and 11, of course, live. We're going to keep that going all summer long. With that said, we're going to keep streaming those services forever and ever and ever because it's really important for those of you who can't make it physically to church to still be a part of our church. We value that very much in our church leadership, in our staff, with our elders. Uh, and we love that we have that option available. So if you're in town, come to church. If not, we'd love to have you join us online. Let us know that you're there. Again, as we talk about evangelism, as we think about what the Apostle Paul tells us, we're not ashamed of the gospel, or we ought not be. Uh, we ought to be willing to tell our stories because we want the Christian impact in our lives to be a part of other people's lives, especially those who are lost, those who don't know Jesus, who haven't uh, connected with church yet and faith yet and all that kind of stuff. So um, that's every one of our jobs. We have that responsibility and that calling. So be thinking about that this week. Maybe there's somebody you know you need to talk to and you just haven't figured out how to do so yet. Uh, maybe it's time to get there. 
Until next time, I'll look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks on This Week with Pastor Dino. Bye-bye.